Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Cloudy Nerf. And as you can see here, this is going to be an episode on a little pocket watch about blaster I made here. Made out of an SSP and something I picked up from Walmart a long time ago, a little dashboard clock. It looks all kind of fine and well and nice until you actually kind of get into the thing here. And it's been beat up, chewed up, and whacked up. And everything's held together by tape. They can actually get at the back and stuff because that more or less is an alarm clock, which is kind of cool. And the SSP still works as a blaster, which is great. Uh, unfortunately, I uh, just don't use it for a watch and stuff anymore. But my buddy Oz decided uh, he liked it so much when I sent the picture, he sent me that nice little beautiful picture in the corner up there up on top of my videos and everything like that. It's got that little says clowny nerf. You can look at the page, you can you know, see it flat out. He took really cool job doing that and I like it so much I decided to uh, make that part of my lo part of my logos and things but this isn't so much about this old blaster it's about something else uh, an upgrade which is actually my first commission officially as clowny nerf it's kind of cool uh, same old watch face but I managed to do a lot of little tricks that made it a lot better instead of just cutting a big gaping hole in the side of it this time I used a lot of putty and sit there and sanded it all down. I didn't completely go all the way down because I still want a bit of a rough look because it's supposed to have some steampunky to it so I wanted that kind of handcrafted kind of look to it so some of the larger dents and little incursions are left on the blaster itself and I think it makes it look a little slicker. And as with all commissions, you know, you got to go all out. So I dirtied up the little faux black leather grip it's got down here, added some nice little silver detailings and uh, Florence, Florence, I'm not sure exactly how you pronounce it. I know it's a French word, uh, but these little, these little designs here with a bunch of little fake rivets and some more silver detailing and up over the top and then the old fashioned, you know, pen top holder to make it look just like it's supposed to be nice and pretty and it still pops and works just like it's supposed to this guy's going to be out in the mail and I got a part with it which is kind of unfortunate because I really do appreciate it over the uh, upgrade that this one itself was but you can't have everything and unfortunately uh, somebody else has got to get what they paid for so it's going to be out in the mail. By the time you see this video, you should already have this thing. I hope that's the way it's going to work out because I don't plan on posting until after I know that you actually managed to get this thing and put it up because spoilers suck. You guys uh, like these kinds of videos and like me making these little steampunk things and all kinds of nostalgic stuff like that. Give me a thumbs up. I really would appreciate it. If you want to don't uh, want to see any more of these things or you have any ideas, give me a thumbs down and tell me about your thumbs down in the box below. I mean, that's what the comment section is for. I read everything in the comment section. I make a wholehearted attempts to respond to everything. It, although it is getting harder and harder, but I'd love to talk to all my fans. It's nice to give you guys at least a comment because you've been there. And if you think... Uh, this kind of stuff like this is like interesting and you know learning to do like my rest of my stuff hell go to Facebook I put up all kinds of videos and things on Facebook that I don't put up on here and updates and stuff from the channel and sometimes just blatant stupidity and stuff I find off the internet that I might find funny like subscribe comment that's what you say at the end of these things remember your buddy clowny's watching peace